The Justice Department or DOJ cleared Senator Coco Pimentel of breaching quarantine last year. In March 2020, Pimentel went to the Makati Medical Center to accompany his wife who was about to give birth. Critics claim the senator violated protocols because he took a COVID-19 test just days before going to the hospital. His COVID-19 test result turned out positive. In a statement, the DOJ argues Pimentel is not a public health authority and is not obliged to report on the Republic Act 11332. Such a law punishes the non-cooperation of certain people in a health crisis. But this is the same law that the DOJ uses to warn quarantine violators of warrantless arrests. Justice Secretary Minardo Guevara said in March last year, quarantine violators can be charged under Section 9 of the law. Thousands were arrested and many more suffered from prolonged detention for breaching quarantine rules. In a statement, Pimentel says the DOJ decision is unassailable and correct. But Rico Kicho, the lawyer who filed the complaint against the senator, says this sends out the message that ordinary people must suffer the full extent of the law while those in power get a free pass. In other news, the Philippines is set to receive its first doses of a COVID-19 vaccine from the Gavi Vaccine Alliance COVAX facility within the first quarter of 2021. Vaccines are Carlito Galvez Jr. and Health Secretary Francisco Duque III confirmed this Wednesday, January 20. Uh-huh.